star is about to explode. And we can watch this happen in real time with just the naked eye. You will be looking to the east of Hercules and all of a sudden there'll be a star there that wasn't there before. Sometime between now and September, the recurrent nova T. Corona Borealis will have an outburst. T. Corona Borealis, it's just part of the system of two stars that are orbiting around each other. So you have a white dwarf, uh, which is the leftover core of a collapsed star. And then you pair it with a red giant, the white dwarf's intense gravity will pull material from the red giant. So this will cause a massive buildup of material on the surface of the white dwarf, where the temperature is going to climb higher and higher. So this kind of intense heat will eventually blow the outer layer of the white dwarf surface into this spectacular explosion. It will go from requiring a small telescope to see all the way up to becoming visible to the unaided eye, about as bright as the North Star Polaris. But not for long. The phenomenon will last about a week before the nova fades to its non-luminous state for 80 years. This object has already dazzled us with two incredible eruptions in the past. The first one happened in 1866, the second one was in 1946. There have been some historical recordings of such events in the 1200s, uh, but people really were not paying such a close attention. It's a, a really unique opportunity for us to witness the most luminous nova of our time. There are two solar eclipses on the surface of the Earth per year, right? How often do we see an exploding star? 